morning, everyone. This is Dr. George. Today here we have Sebag. Hello, good morning. For Sebag, we're gonna be working on zone one, zone two. We're targeting 3,000 grafts for him. But the good news for him is when we first did the consultation, he needed about 32 to 3,500, but he started using mm -hmm. minoxidil. This was about eight, nine months ago. And he sprouted a good amount of hair. So congratulations, Seb. You're gonna be less grafts, you're welcome. <laughs> Um, so like I said, we're going to work on zone one, zone two for you. We're also going to do a session of PRP, okay? All right. Sounds All right. good. How are you feeling? Feeling great. Nervous? Excited? excited? Good. Excited. Very good. <laughs> I'm happy to hear that. Okay, Seba. So what we're going to do now is we're going to start the haircut, okay? All right. When was the last yeah. time you've uh, clipped your hair? Last time I clipped my hair? Probably about 12 years ago? Yeah. 10 years ago? Something around there. It's been a while. Good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna clip the back for now, and then later on we're gonna clip all the rest of it off. Okay. So all right. you'll get to see what your head looks like after 12 <laughs> years. Ready? Ready. The donor looks fantastic, sir. Right? It's very good, nice and strong. Thank you. Just putting the final touches on the flipping set up. Alright. So, what I'm going to do next is draw out the grid on the back of your head in the donor so that we can harvest equal number of grafts so it doesn't look too condensed in one area. Okay, okay. thank you. How many grids do you guys usually draw? It's person to person dependent size of the donor. We can definitely let you know how many squares you have, okay? All right, so Lux, so your grid is complete. I'm okay. just gonna do a quick count and I'll let you know how many you have since you're mm -hmm. curious, okay? You have 24 squares. Okay. okay. All right, good. Rosie, if I can have the calculator, please. Okay, very good. So we're targeting 3,000 follicles for you, Sevag, with 24 squares on the grid. That comes up to about 125 follicles for each one of these 24 squares, okay? Okay. Very good. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to disinfect. You're going to feel something cold, okay? It's really cold. <laughs> it's refreshing. It is. Okay, Sevag, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to numb the donor area. Mm -hmm. You're going to feel a series of pokes here, here, quick break, then here, and here again, okay? Okay. This is the most sensitive part for this phase, this phase okay? So I apologize. Okay. And one more thing you should know, have some guns. Thank you. One more thing you should know is there's a little bit of adrenaline in this medication. So if you, if you feel your heart beating harder, faster, stronger, mm -hmm. it's not because of your anxiety, it's because of the adrenaline, okay? Okay. What it does, it helps to slow down the bleeding. Ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. And your heart, in the meantime, has to compensate by beating a little bit harder. Okay? Okay. Good. 
and that vibration device you're feeling on the back of your neck helps to distract your nerves so you don't feel most of these folks. Get some juice for Sabog. <laughs> How was that? Part one down. Yes. It was not too bad. Yeah. Like <laughs> I said, it is the most sensitive part of this phase, and you did awesome, okay? Ready? I guess so. <laughs> as ready as you'll be, right? Yeah. Huh? So I'm going to come down this way. And then this way, so okay. All right, one, two. You're doing awesome. We're almost done. Almost done. Three, two, and one. Very good. And now we're gonna do the top part, okay? One, two. Done. Very good. So the team is going to get you in position and we're going to get started on phase one, which is the first of four phases, the harvesting phase. Okay? Okay. Very good. You got that? Yes, okay. Are you having any pain, Sabo? No, not at all, actually. Good. Congratulations, right. you finished phase one harvesting and cool. your numbers came nice. out really great. You want to hear them? Definitely, yeah. All right. Get it? So the our numbers. total graph count is 3,143 graphs, uh, 341 singles, 792 doubles, and 2,010 triples and on. Okay, so that was 11% singles. 25% doubles and 64% triples and plus. Nice. Okay. Those are fantastic nice. numbers, Selog. So hopefully you'll get some really great results out of All right. this. We were targeting between 3,000 and 3,200. We got 3,143 for you. So we got right exactly where we need to be, okay? Okay, Very sounds good. good. So congratulations on finishing phase one. Now we're gonna move on to phase two, which is the design phase, okay? All right, this is nice. the fun part where <laughs> I'll show you what we're gonna do, different designs of hairlines, see what you like, mm -hmm. and then we'll finalize it towards the end, okay? Okay, sounds good. All right. All right. All right, Sabak, so what we're going to do now is take some measurements of your face so we can see what your proportions are and come up with the area that we're going to put the hair on for you, okay? okay? So the first measurement we're going to take is going to be chin to eyebrow. So for you, it's about 14, 14 and a half. So the perfect proportions would be half of that. So half of 14 is 7, so we're mm -hmm. aiming for about 7, 7 and a quarter. That'll give you the equal proportions of mouth, chin, eyes, nose, hairline, forehead. Okay. okay. So like we discussed, Savag, mm -hmm. the proportions that we discussed, the seven, seven and a half centimeters, when I checked, if you raise your eyebrows for me, you never had a hairline that high. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna place the hairline a little bit higher mm -hmm. and that'll give you the more natural look. Okay. Because like we discussed, zone one is the first two centimeters after we place the hairline and zone two is the next five. So the higher up the hairline is, actually the further coverage and moving back you go. So okay. if the hairline is here, for example, you might only get coverage from here to here. Obviously that's an exaggeration, but <laughs> if we place it all the way up here, 
your seven centimeters will go all the way back to here, so you'll get further coverage moving back. Okay. Got it. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So what we're gonna do to, do now is get started on the design. Okay. Okay. Right. Sounds good. I'll turn face me down a little. Okay, so, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to give you the mirror so you can take a look at the two different designs that I did, okay? Okay. On the right side, it's something a little bit more youthful versus the left, which is a little more conservative. Okay. okay. Here you go. Let me know what you think about both. They both do look good. I think maybe I'm leaning a little bit more towards the right side. Okay. So what I'll do now then so is I'll make the left side look a little more like the right side. Mm -hmm. Add some finishing touches and we'll show you again, okay? Okay. All right. Okay, so look. So the conservative and the youthful look that we gave you, I decided to go with a kind of a hybrid of the two, where the conservative side came down just a bit and the youthful side went up just a bit. And I think that made a huge difference if you want to take a look. Mm -hmm. That's that's very nice. I love it. Awesome. So yeah. we don't ever great. want it to be 100% identical. Mm -hmm. 95, 97 is, is where we want it to be because if it's too identical, what happens is it screams artificial. Mm -hmm. And that's a look that we don't want you to have. So what I'm going to do now for you, Selog, is break down your different zones, okay? Okay. So as we know, the first two centimeters after the hairline is zone one. Yes. So if I can have a marker, please. Yes. Thank you. Edith, if I can have another marker, please. Yes. What I'm going to do is break down zone two now, which is the next five centimeters, okay? Right here. Across this way. So we broke down zone one and zone two. Like we had discussed previously, Sevag, zone one is going to have double the density of zone two mm -hmm. in terms of the implanted follicles, okay? Okay. And don't forget, we're also gonna do that PRP session for you. Okay. To give you that little extra boost, we're gonna shower those newly grafted follicles mm -hmm. with growth factors, and that's gonna improve the survival rate as well as you'll have some sooner growth and faster healing as well. Perfect, okay. sounds great. Yeah, absolutely. And coupled with those awesome numbers that you had with your mm -hmm. density of the follicles, hopefully you'll have some great results, okay? All right. All right. So we're gonna Exciting. shave soon, yeah? <laughs> Very much so. Ready? Ready. Awesome. All right, so Edith is putting on the chuck and we're gonna start the shave soon, okay? All right. All right, when was the last time you had your head shaved? Um, Probably about like 12 years ago. Right. So it's been a while. We're gonna get to see it again soon, okay? <laughs> All right. All right, so I'll 
Promise not to bother your beard, okay? Yeah, but don't go too low. <laughs> I don't mind a nice fade, though. I'll take care of that. Don't <laughs> worry. When was the last time you saw your head shaved again, Seth? 12 years? Yeah, it's about right. All right, here, take a look. Oh, wow. <laughs> so that's what your design looks like, your zone one, your zone two. Mm -hmm. What I'm gonna do now is go over the pencil with a marker, okay? So okay. it's important that you keep your head extremely still at this point. Okay. Got it. So what I'm doing now is just reinforcing the markings for zone one, zone two. And what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna place those random irregular hairs in front of the hairline to give it a softer appearance, okay? okay? Put that down. Do you have another marker, please? Don't move your head, don't raise your eyebrows, okay? There's the softeners, all done. What I'm gonna do is hand you the mirror now so you can take a look, okay? All right. There you go. That looks great. Awesome. So that looks awesome. These softeners are to give the hairline a softer appearance. Mm -hmm. And what that does is it doesn't have that straight line architecture of something that's been manufactured. It gives it a more natural look. Okay. All right. So we're gonna start the incision soon, but first we're gonna give you a few injections to do some numbing, okay? okay so okay. what we're gonna do now is we're gonna disinfect your eyebrows. Okay. We're gonna do two quick pokes in each eyebrow for the supraorbital and trochlear nerves, and what that's gonna do is numb 70, 80% of the scalp, okay? Okay. This is the most sensitive part of the face, so no sudden movements, no jerking, so we don't get the needle where we don't want it to be, okay? Okay. Okay, so uh, so, we already disinfected. You're gonna feel that vibration device that I was telling you about. Mm -hmm. You're gonna feel two quick pokes, one here, one here, and then two more on the other side, one here and one here, okay? Mm -hmm. No sudden movements. This is the most sensitive part for this phase, okay? Ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. One, two, three. Side's all done. Well, I'm gonna do the right side, okay? One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. How was that? That one hurt a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> As to be expected, these are tear jerkers. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go back in here and here you shouldn't feel it nearly as much, okay? Okay. Ready? Uh-huh. One, two. How was that? It's a lot better. Okay. One, two. All right. So I'm gonna go back in here. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. All done. We're gonna give this a few minutes to kick in. We'll get you in position and we'll get started, okay? All right. All right, Savar, we're almost done. Just 
for a few short minutes. I'm just spot treating a few areas here in zone three to blend it in a little bit better. Okay. You're getting awesome density, okay? Sounds great. Yep. And we already drew the blood for the PRP. It's mm -hmm. spinning now, and once it's done, we're gonna put that in, and like I said before, the PRP should help improve the survival rate of the grafts. Okay. As well as give you some sooner growth, as well as faster healing, okay? All right, that sounds good. Yep. All right. All right, Seva, congratulations. You're almost done with the procedure. There's only one phase left, implanting, okay? Okay. How was lunch? Lunch was really good, actually. Like, good. kebab was really good. Fantastic, you got the so filet. Steak, yeah, the steak kebab, really good. Awesome, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna take the cap off. Do you wanna see the results? Do you wanna I see do, what it looks like? yeah. Awesome. Definitely excited to see this. So I'm gonna take the cap off now, okay? Ready? I'm ready. Here you go. Take a look. Moment of truth. Oh wow. Wow, that's gonna be awesome. Yeah. That's awesome. It looks fantastic, Savag. And because you have such good numbers, <clears throat> the level of the level of triples that you're gonna have is gonna extend nice and far back. Okay? okay. We were actually able to get some distribution into your zone three wow. which is gonna blend really well okay that's awesome all right amazing so if i can have a marker please here's what we're gonna do we're gonna use singles for the hairline three to four rows to give it that soft appearance mm -hmm. and if you can just lean your head just a bit back we're gonna have triples all the way up to about here. Almost your, your entire zone one and part of your zone two actually. All gonna be threes and everything behind it, twos. Mm. Okay. Wow. So threes, nice. threes, and twos in your strongest area. Okay. Okay. Right, and what we're gonna do next is we're gonna do the PRP, okay? Okay. All right, so, so what you get to do now is watch a movie. You get to choose between Netflix, HBO, Showtime, whatever we have available. And in the meantime, I'm gonna do your PRP for you, okay? All right, sounds good. You shouldn't feel a thing. It should all be nice and numb. Uh, that's right. The procedure. Feels like you're wearing a steel helmet, right? Yeah, exactly. Maybe you can watch The Man in the Iron Mask. <laughs> You'll feel like you could relate a little bit. Seva, congratulations, you're all done. Woohoo! I have to say, you had some of the densest graphs that I've ever seen. Nice. You have so many sixes and sevens. That's great. So I'm really looking forward to what your results are going to look like in six months. Nice. All right. I'm excited for that too.
Awesome. So you haven't seen it with the Gratzen yet? No, I have not. You just saw it after the design was implemented with the incisions, right? That's correct. Very good. Okay. So I'm going to sit you up and hand you a mirror, okay? Okay. Moment of truth. Yep. Here you go. Take a look. Wow, that is awesome. What do you think, Sava? Do you like it or do you love it? Oh, I definitely love it. Yeah, that's awesome. That's amazing. Good. Congratulations. You're all done. Thank you. If you liked what you guys saw, please like, subscribe to our YouTube page, follow us on Instagram, la.fue.hair.clinic to follow Silva's results and see how this is going to turn out in a couple of months, okay? All right. <laughs>